Welcome back to my channel. So today in this video, uh, you are going to discover really cool and simple casual outfit that you can wear on if you have a day job, a nine to five job, you can wear on a casual Friday. So all the outfits are being uh, built around one pair of dark jeans, okay? Because some companies don't like the light or with the holes. So this is what I've done. And if you work for yourself like me and you can be casual smart every day, even meeting new clients, that will suit you as well. And if you don't have a job and you don't need to work, but you still have some ideas about casual smart outfit, or maybe you're just planning a weekend away and you don't know what to wear in the weekend, kind of a mid-season, watch this video and you will learn something. I just started my uh, channel uh, last week, something absolutely crazy happened. Um, I received an email from YouTube, my first with 100 subscribers. Yay! Uh, I know it's not much, but to me it's a lot because I'm starting three weeks ago. Plus, I'm starting to um, have a lot of, a lot, some followers and we start connecting with each other and messaging on Instagram and it's uh, what a lovely community and I, I'm very, very touched from the bottom of my heart. So I know it's baby steps, but uh, gosh, thank you. <laughs> anyway, let's rock and let's discover those super cool casual smart and what to wear on a casual Friday. All right, so first outfit is a classic dark blue jean that I roll around the ankles with a nice v-neck t-shirt, nice earrings, very discreet necklace, a really designer belt. You've seen this belt? Yes, I have only one, but it's a classic one and I love it. And nice nude uh, high heels. This can take you anywhere from weekends, cinemas, Friday, working corporate clients meeting, and if you live in a bit of a colder country or you have in like some areas like four seasons in one day, yeah, trust me, there's some areas like Melbourne in, in Australia, you can obviously topping up with a nice uh, white jacket. Uh, I love it, white on white. It's never the same white, obviously, unless you're really lucky or you buy everything in yeah. pure white and you show that everything is the same. You can put over your shoulder or just wearing as a normal jacket. Some people could have a blazer, but I think it's more like a jacket because it's a bit shorter. I tried the blazer uh, personally and it doesn't suit me because I'm too short and it looks like it's crushing my my silhouette. So blazer are not good for me. Even they look cool, but no, hashtag no blazer for me. <laughs> so okay, you can tell it's casual, but it's still classy. And um, it's um, it can go anywhere. So even if you have a bus meeting on, on this Friday with those blue jeans, but because the top is casual and classic, you can really reuse really yourself. The second one is my uh, very corporate dress shirt that I wear so many times, the print one. And this time I wear a little bit with a bit of funky way over the blue jeans. I kept the same designer belts. I'm really trying to simplify the look with the nude high heels and just to be sure that you can uh, replicate a similar look with your own clothes. Or I can do like a double knot in the front, which is a bit cheeky, but again, it's not very risky for the office. Uh, I went to see a couple of clients like that, it's totally fine. And uh, I'm comfortable, I look a bit corporate, I look a bit casual, or it looks like I'm being conflicting <laughs> with my feet. Sorry, I'm just watching the computer here because the video is going there. Um, so it, it just, here we go. But I don't want to look down, so I don't know. I need to find a solution with that. And the, maybe like this, the other outfit, love, love this shirt. Big winner, it's like um, light skin, pink peach. When you're a bit tan, and I'm always a bit tan, uh, it's a very nice contrast. Very classy. The only problem with this shirt is a bit transparent, so you have to wear a really nice brow underneath if you want to show a bit of an injury, but discreetly. Sorry for the noise in the background. That's again Oscar who's snoring. 
And this time I just put a note in the front and a little bit of the back. So I'm trying with clients or on casual Friday, if I work in an organization, not to show too much of my house, even if it's a nice ass. Um, it's just because you wear a very skinny jeans in this case and the message is not right, okay? So this super blue corporate shirt that I wear so many times when I used to work in corporate in the city, uh, this time I put in a bit inside, when it was a bit outside, yeah, I'm having an issue with the color, obviously, so it's, I'm the person to blame, I'm the person who I run, so, you know, and uh, again, a little bit of the texture, uh, textile, sorry, or the fabrics at the back, just to hide a bit the bottom or the derriere, and just a bit of a showing again on the belt. Second one is a, that's not the second one, sorry, the other one, I don't remember which one now, the blouse. So this is a silk blouse I bought years ago and I can match with this one with everything. With a very dark pants when I'm super corporate, when I have meetings or presentation, or with a jeans, it's turning down straight away. Uh, it's good for a date as well because it's a bit sexy, but you're not showing too much, kind of a, sending the wrong message. Perfect for weekends. This time I put my flats in the ballerinas and not only I'm comfortable, I look chic. Uh, it's just getting a bit of a break outside of just wearing a t-shirt. And I'm a t-shirt girl. And uh, I got as well my trainers from Adidas. That's one of my favorites. Um, Personally, I think those shoes are a little bit too casual for the office. But again, it depends. You can be working in a very creative office as a designer or work as a lawyer. And I'm sure as a lawyer, you can't wear this. So uh, again, but if you're a lawyer and you're going for a weekend, you can definitely have it. The other one, and that's my favorite outfit for a weekend, is my very classic white and blue striped shirt. It's a very soft cotton, easy to iron, which is even better. It suits everything, white pants, blue jeans. Um, again, very easy. So this one with the white sneakers, yes, it's a it's a win-win outfit. Uh, I love this shirt. So if you can find just one like that, that's going to last you for, for, for years. And it goes almost with everything. And uh, yeah, it's classy, you see. So yeah, I really love that. I wore this shirt in some weekends. <laughs> so again, depends about the season. Let's say it's a bit cold or it's just raining, you know. Just put this denim shirt, and yes, denim on denim look are still super cool. So use that as super cool. Arrange a bit the sleeves, that's always good. Uh, this time I pop my uh, yellow high heels. I know, this only, I don't know why I put the shoes, but they are crazy. Sometimes I just wear all black and I got this yellow shoes. Sorry, back to the outfit. Um, so... Jeans on jeans, white t-shirt, classic belt, high heels, weekends. Uh, yes, Oxa is always in the background. It's just there right now. And I think that's, again, you are quite safe to go to the office with that. Only note, if you have a décolletage, be careful when you bend a bit over. Uh, sometimes you might show your boobs when you don't want to. And this time it's more like for a weekend, a little bit like uh, dressed up. So it's with my favorite trench coat. Uh, so that will again elevate the outfit straight away. A nice designer bag. If you don't have a designer bag, do not panic. Just use a nice structure bag, same for the belt, you know. Um, but that's an outfit I will definitely wear for weekends in fall or end of winter, which is fall or spring or when the weather is like funny. This time I put my brown mules with a little bit the same color of the uh, Louis Vuitton handbag and I love it. All right, so yes, that's it. So this is very funny because I have to do two videos. <laughs> anyway. Back to you guys. So uh, I hope you learned something and you got a bit of a value out of this video and I inspire you in terms of outfit and say, oh, I haven't thought about mixing this bottom with this or effectively this is quite safe for the office and on the evening I can just pop some high heels, a bit of lipstick and I can go out on Friday night or for a drink. 
And if you do believe it brings you some value and you think you can uh, really like this channel, please. Uh, first of all, it should be my Instagram somewhere. I'm growing my Instagram in the same time as the YouTube, but the YouTube is really what I really want to do. All right, guys. Well, uh, I hope you like this video. It was really fun to create and I hope that it brings you a bit of a value and give you some inspiration, ideas, what to wear on a casual Friday or what to wear on weekends or what to wear for a casual day night job. I don't know what I'm talking about now, but if you do, please, please share this video with your friends, family, girlfriends, like it, subscribe. Don't forget the little bell because I need your support. I need your help to, uh, to grow this channel and uh, I'm already start uh, connecting with this community. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. Look, my smile. <laughs> so thank you all of you. Um, I see you very soon and probably forgot to tell you what I have to say, but um, I'm really touched. 100 subscribers, it's, it's insane to me and uh, yeah, I'm super happy. So I'll see you soon. I wish you a lovely day. You take care of yourself. 